How many moles are there in 15 grams of lithium? Well, you can calculate a number of moles from a mass by dividing by the molar mass of the particles themselves. You might remember this from another video of mine. You convert grams to moles by dividing by molar mass. But the question is, what is the molar mass of lithium? Well, lithium itself is a metal, which means that we treat each individual atom as its own molecule. And the molar mass is the atomic mass from the periodic table. So that's 6.941, no calculation needed. I'm going to take the number of grams and I'm going to divide it by the molar mass of lithium, which is actually the atomic mass of lithium, 6.941. And once I do this calculation, I should be done. Now, I just want to point out, it, you can't use 15.999 for oxygen or any of the non-metals really, but that's because oxygen molecules are O2. And if you were asked about solid sulfur, some people write that as S8, etc, etc. So you kind of have to know what the molecular form of each of the elements is, unless your teacher's telling you exactly. Anyways, lithium's a metal, so it's easy. You just use it from the periodic table directly. Let's do 15 divided by 6.941. Bam! I get an answer of 2.16107 moles. Now you might think I'm done, but chemists love significant figures. Now my atomic mass here had one, two, three, four sig figs, or significant digits or whatever you call them. But the original number I was given only had two, which means this needs to get rounded to two significant figures. There's my first one. There's my second one. So I look at the next number, it's more than five, and therefore I round this number up, which means the final answer you're supposed to give here is 2.2 moles. I know the calculator didn't give that to you, but here in science, you've got to round to the correct precision, no matter what your calculator gives you. And I'm here to help you with that. Thanks for being with me. Hope this made it clear, and best of luck.